How goodly are your tents, O Jacob? It's an awkward phrase. The Hebrew, Ma tovu o halecha Yaakov, is much more beautiful. It's a phrase from the Torah portion Balak. Sure, it was my bar mitzvah portion, wink wink, hello 1994, but even if it wasn't, it would be my all-time favorite. Ma tovu specifically sings of praise, of praise from a wizard, Balaam, who was commanded to curse the Israelites in the desert by King Balak. But, thanks in part to a talking donkey, literally changes his tune. When I was 13, I took this quite concretely to mean the power of words in my Devar Torah, that in our lives and in our world, each blessing or words of praise and support can perpetuate future kindness, mitzvot, and goodwill to ourselves and others, and that the opposite, curses, hate language, slander, can sadly perpetuate the opposite. Today, I think about the ma tovu possibilities in our work nurturing Jewish community. How can we each be the wizards that provide the words of praise, of blessings, that can perpetuate and strengthen our real and metaphorical dwellings for generations to come? As the saying goes, with great power comes great responsibility. It's scary when we recognize the impact our words will have, our wizard-like powers that fall into curse mode, and can perpetuate ignorance, absenteeism, bad management, or worse. So when I do my work in the Jewish community, I have this line, ma tovu, at the front of my mind. You might say I keep a talking donkey on my shoulder, reminding me that it's blessings and not curses that build community. <laughs>